Hi, I'm Bart. Hi, I'm Gio. I'm Joe. I'm Tiffany, and you're watching Ask, Ask the Feels. And today we have a question from Jake. I'm having trouble with my girlfriend. We've been dating for four months and she gets really jealous. I've done nothing to lose her trust, but she still gets really worried. How can I gain her trust and stop her worries? Thanks. That's tough because I'm pretty sure he probably tried all the normal shit. Like, you gotta just trust me. <laughs> like, I'm pretty sure he tried talking to her and he's just lost all options. And if you haven't talked to her yet, what the fuck, man? You gotta first talk to her and just be like, dude, you gotta fucking trust me. Or else there should be no reason why we're in this relationship. Are you guys, uh, are you girls the jealous types? <laughs> Am I a jealous type? You, you are, but are you a jealous type? <laughs> They're Latinas, of course. <laughs> I don't get jealous. I just get... I guess if you give me a reason to feel insecure, then I will feel insecure. Because, like, if you're hiding things and, like, not communicating, then I'm going to think that you're hiding things for a reason. There's more than that. And then that's going to make my imagination run wild, and I'm going to start mm. thinking the worst of shit. So if, it's, if there's communication, then there, they will, there will be trust. So let's say you're with this guy <clears throat> named Tony Baloney. And Tony Baloney, like if Tony Salami, and he is like, in his industry, he's always hugging with girls. He's introducing, hey Tiff, this is this girl, whatever. And you constantly see him working with another girl and texting this other girl. It doesn't make you uncomfortable at all? If he had that open communication and saying, hey, you know what, this purely professional, of course I would trust him. Because he's, he's putting me in that position of, look, I respect you enough to talk to you about what I'm going to do. and what I'm going about and I'm not gonna go about it behind your back, yeah. I can respect that. I can trust him then. He's giving me my place so I can trust him. But if he's like in the bed like... <laughs> yeah, then what the fuck? And then, and then and you go, who's that? And then he's like, oh, it's Serena. Then you're like, Serena? Who the fuck is Serena? Yeah, I think it's all in how the... the at least for me. I don't know other women. But for me, it's all in how the guy handles the situation with whoever he's talking to. He could even be doing that with a guy and I'm gonna be like, wait, hold on, what is... Like, what's going on? Why are you talking to Elvis like that? Yeah, yeah why are you giggling with Bart all the time? What the fuck? Mm. How come you laugh at his jokes but not mine? <laughs> it is a two-way street for to build trust. Yeah, um, for sure. You gotta kind of like think ahead and, and think about your actions. Will this action lead her to think maybe I might be sticking my dick in this girl? Because yeah. if it is, you might want to take the other route. Yeah. But if, if she's just like been your friend, like let's say you're gonna go visit your friend and you, you've been friends with her before you even got with this girl or whatever, and you don't want her to think shit, just be just tell her your relationship with her. Just be like, dude, this this is like my sister. Like we've been around and we, we are gonna continue being friends, you know, whether we're together or not. And you gotta respect that. You gotta be upfront, man. You gotta man up and, and tell her straight up. Clearly communicate what your relationship is with these girls and how you want to maintain that relationship with them, how important those relationships are. Because if you really think about it too, if it's not that important to like be their friend, why? Why, why keep them around? But if they're like your sisters and you're like, fuck yeah, like I, I gotta keep these relationships, then you gotta tell her like, hey, if you wanna be my girl, you gotta respect my friendships too. Cause then like true. put yourself in her situation if you're not doing that. And she has guy friends that she's all flirty with and she hides the fact that she's talking to them. Patrick. Just things like that. Like, then of course you're gonna feel insecure too and jealous too. It's just, it's all how they handle the situation and the communication, then there'll be trust. Yeah, because a lot of young people, they, they feel like there should be immediate, unconditional trust without building a relationship. They go, well, you just fucking trust me. It's like, well, there's no reason. You gotta explain shit to people. You gotta let them understand or else they're always gonna be asking questions. And if she's just fucking crazy, then she's just fucking crazy. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure to like the video and also follow us on all our social media in the description below. And here's the last video over here. Paying attention to for Isaac. I know. I mean, he's just 13. He needs to give his...